Hello, it's Ariel Lords the Intuitive, and I decided to do a divine masculine to do divine feminine message. Please know that this may or may not resonate. Take what resonates, leave the rest. And so let's get into what we have here. So I picked, I went ahead and let the cards fly out. And pretty amazing is we have three out of these four uh, cards, major arcana, so which are which are major. Uh, shifts, uh, things occurring in, in the lot in your life, or you know, divine masculine, divine feminine, and so it's really cool. We have the we have the tower. Okay, we have the tower. We have, I believe, this is the sun card, and we have third eye chakra. Okay, tower is about rebuilding. But what's interesting about the tower call, card rebuild is I notice. Let's see how she's like. She's guarding her heart, okay, as it looks like the structure is getting, it's like the base of the structure is getting rebuilt, is being, um, yeah, it's being rebuilt. So there's a rebuild going on, and what's under, what we got with this from my Divine Masculine deck, deck is the thought of losing you is so unbearable, so I really feel like Definitely for divine masculines, um, towards the divine feminines, um, even though you can't lose the other person really because you're always connected, um, and there's no separation. So, but the thought of losing you is so unbearable. It's so, it's just, it's destructive, I guess is the word is coming through. Um, there's a rebuild. There's, it's, I feel like they're, they're saying like, um, they have to, they know that they have to rebuild something with you. And the thought of losing you is so unbearable that look at, I mean, her heart, she's just like the heart, his heart just can't like take it <laughs> kind of a thing. So let's continue on. We have shine. We have the star, I don't know, this is not the star, but the, the sun, the sun card is the happiest card. It's just, she's bursting out with light. And it's also from the heart chakra, so lots of heart chakra indications here of shine that's shining and that's being expressed. Uh, maybe some activations in the heart chakra, and then we have the third eye chakra. There's that that third eye, that vision, the inner vision, clairvoyancy, and all of that. Okay, so with the sun card, we have your smile lights me up, a little happy face. <laughs> so pretty self-explanatory with the shine card. They see you as the sunshine, the sun, um, joyful, magnetic, just powerful being, and it, it radiates. Your smile lights me up. Then we have third eye chakra. I daydream about our life together. So I love how it's all connected uh, with these three cards. Uh, the third eye, that's where a lot of that visions, day, when you're daydreaming, it comes through that third eye and yeah I really feel and sense a lot of times this are spent even during working time when they're working a lot of daydreaming a lot of thoughts about the future um what what it would be like yeah so there's definitely a rebuilding tower moments going on I feel like especially within their heart chakra of not wanting to lose they're divine feminine, but of course, um, on the spiritual journey, nothing is really lost as well, and there's no separation because it's a spiritual connection. Therefore, it, it starts with spirit first and foremost. Okay, so, and then I thought this was cool. The bottom of the deck flipped it over. It's a chariot card. It's movement. The hands, the hand fasting coming together in this love and then I pulled a card for that this connection is a roller coaster ride and I love it <laughs> so I thought that was really awesome that it came with the move card and roller coaster and I did tell you guys about my a dream I had um, about the roller coaster was in my dream being on that with my masculine and being on the top about to go down like oh my gosh like this is like a roller coaster ride, this connection, and I love it. <laughs> so I thought that's really cool, you know, moving in, moving towards love, moving towards the truth, 
which is this connection, which is unconditional love, what it's about. So that's really cool. And then the healing card. This is the star card. I'm very protective of you. I want you to feel safe and loved. So definitely, definitely a lot of energy. Uh, they want to heal this. They want to heal what it, um, between the Divine Feminine, you, most likely watching Divine Feminine. Okay, so breaking these chains. They really want to break the chains of the past. And then here it is. Again, that heart chakra. Heart, heart, and then heart. Like, it's just bursting. The heart chakra is activated. It's totally connecting to yours. Like, it's, there's daydreaming. You know, your energy just lights lights them up. They, they're very protective of you. Uh, very protective of your energy of 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 feeling safe they want you to feel safe and loved and especially around them you know and i i get that energy as well from the divine masculine and being very careful what energy they bring to their divine feminine and they know that their feminine is high vibing or trying to really go on their ascension path a lot of feminines are doing their purpose work they're really trying to grow spiritually so they um they're very protective of their feminine. And especially like the higher self of divine masculines are very much like in a beautiful way protective. Not a not a controlling protective. This is very high vibe type of protective energy. But So this is a short message. Really beautiful. I love how it correlates with each card. Um, daydreaming third eye. That's really cool. And then the roller coaster. Roller coaster ride, it is like a roller coaster ride. Those dips, you know, whoo. Okay, so thank you again, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.